Hey guys, take a with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you two different ways to view your purchase history for your Apple account or your iCloud account in order to see all the purchases you made for apps, subscription, or music, anything that's linked to your Apple account. We're going to show you how you can check that. So let's get started. So the first way, it's going to be the simplest way, which is if you're on iPhone or uh, Apple device like iPad, simply go into your setting of your iPhone or that device. Once you're logged in, you should be logged in already there. You click on over there. And once you click on there, you, there should be an option to check a media and purchases. So if you click on media and purchases, you're going to want to click on view account. So once you view account, it might ask you to enter your Apple ID password one more time. Or if not, it will show you this menu here. And under this menu here, there's your purchase history. So if you click on that, it will load up all the history. Now here, as you can see here, it's showing for... Uh, 90 days that you paid, you can filter it to um, options for a longer period of time. Now you can also do for free and then you can apply and it'll show you everything that you have purchased on your account, whether it's paid or free. But here you can adjust the filter accordingly or any types as well for things like apps, in-app purchases, subscription, music, videos. Apple Care and others as well. And you can apply for certain filters if you're looking for a specific filter, or you can even search for the type if you would remember, or even by a charge. Like if you have a charge on your credit card or something, you can search up by charge and it'll show you what's available. Now, this is on the iPhone itself, you're signed in. Now, if you need to um, access this from a browser, maybe you don't have your Apple device with you, you can also do that by going on any browser. Here, I'm going to go on Safari, but you can go on Chrome, Google, whatever it is, and you're going to go to this website for Apple's website, which is reportaproblem.apple.com. Again, that's report a problem, which is one word, dot apple.com. And if you go there, right, it's going to ask you to, of course, sign in with your Apple ID and password that you like to view the history for. So I'm going to continue here. I'm going to enter my Apple ID password now. Once you have entered your Apple ID password, you're going to simply sign in just like that on the browser. And once you're logged in, what will happen is it will also show you the history of all your purchases. Now, again, same thing. You can search by price here if you're looking for a specific tire. You can just scroll and take a look at all the purchases you made. Here showing me the free ones as well, but you can find any charge that you were ever charge on your Apple account and from there on of course if you like to request a refund or if you had issues with it you can follow along with all of these options that are available and you select the option to go ahead and process that so that's how you look at history of purchases on your Apple account I hope this video was helpful if so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time